Hey, good early day, good afternoon, or good evening. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? And how y'all doing some more? Yes, I'm back with um dropping two. Well, I'm doing two videos today, and I just did one on the uh, two seed nut seed nooks that I made, and um so the other day I made a uh, some apple sauce. And that's also in one of my videos. But before I get started, y'all, come on in here and get a virtual hug for me or a digital visual hug. I extend love to all. So, especially to my beginning supporters, to the newcomers who are coming in, to those who just passing by and peeking in to, and see the channel. Come on in and get this hug. And if you don't like hugs, on your way as you were. I appreciate you for stopping by, though. So... As we're hugging in this moment, um, putting a smile on each other's faces and each other's hearts, take in the love, take in the joy, take in and the thankfulness of having a new day with one another and with yourself. So, with that said, y'all, okay, I did a, um, a DIY do-it-yourself applesauce the other day, and I said I was going to put it into a cake. Where well, is the cake? This is a coconut cake. It's not my recipe. Okay. And it didn't come out the way I wanted it to come out because it's my fault. It's not anything the recipe, the recipe did. It's my fault. You know, when you don't, as they say it, when you don't read, right, or use words, if you don't use it, you lose it. Well, you know what? I haven't baked in a while. I love baking, though. And when I was, um, back when I was married and, and, and bringing up my children, I baked all the time, but for some reason, I mean, I want to make a cake, but I did some missteps in this cake, and like I said, it's no no fault of the recipe, it's just my fault, but the point is, it doesn't matter, the cake is going to get it, you see a big old piece out of there anyway, it's going to get it, <laughs> so it's more denser than what I want it to be, and once again, that's my fault, and also, it could it could be a factor that you know what it was supposed to be a three layer cake. You see here is two. And why that may be, you say, well, I didn't have any cake pans. What I had was, or what I have is, I have some deep dish pie plan, pie plan, ah, uh, that pie pans, right? And so, y'all, we in Mercury retrograde. So once again, I'm gonna be, be tongue-tied, tongue tongue, tongue gonna be twisting, the brain gonna be a little slower and, and getting the words out the way it wants to be as far as, you know, how the sentence is gonna flow, the words gonna flow, it's gonna be a little backwards, okay? When Mercury retrograde happens and other planets are also retrograding, we um, have a delay sometimes in our thought patterns, we have a delay in digital, where our, whether it be our cameras, our phones, electronics, cars, Anything electronically, you can have a delay based on the Mercury retrograde specifically. Okay, got that out the way. For those who are into tarot, astronomy, astrology, that's for those. Okay, and for those of you who like don't know about it, now you got a little idea of what it is about and why we may not feel uh, the energies that are on us. Not always in our control. We do the best we can when we know what's around. The energies that are, energies that are here. All right, getting back to this delicious coconut cake, which I don't find it's, it's too dense for me. But and I did use wheat flour, a gluten. It's, it's gluten flour. However, it is no as no organic wheat. There's it's not enriched with anything. So you got all your natural nutrients remaining inside. So, of course, those who are gluten intolerant, you would, if you tried the recipe, you would use something that's a gluten intolerant uh, flour. Okay? So, with this here cake, this coconut cake, I did use my applesauce, which is another replacement for eggs. Okay? For those who don't use eggs, it's another replacement for eggs, and it will give it its moistness. Also, you know, you can also use, use your nuts. And uh, also as egg replacements, okay? Specifically flax seeds, but any nut butter can also 
be the, do the replacement of eggs and you have a nice cake or bread or whatever you're gonna make so yeah so with this cake here like i said it's supposed to be a three layer cake and it's not i had i did have three pie plate pie plates but i figured you know what i'm gonna make it work and i did make it work the best i could <laughs> it probably would have been better if i did have the three cake pans but I don't have any in my possession right now, so I'm gonna make I'm gonna make do with what I have. You see, being that you know we country folks, and there's a there's a uh, video called Country Style. We gonna make it do what it do with what we have on hand, okay? So even though it didn't come out the best way I wanted to, it's still a, a a good cake, and I'm gonna do it again with the same ingredients. I'm just gonna tweak a little bit of them, um, and follow it to the letter this time. Um, the only way I don't think I deviated from was using the cake pans, and even I did some missteps on the ingredients, how, you know, how to put them together. I mean, I know how to put them together, but I got a little ahead of myself, and instead of adding the, um, cake to the moisture, the moisture to the cake, little by little, I just dumped it all in there, and y'all, mm, I got a denser cake, but it's still good. And I did put some, um, I toasted some coconuts, and I put it around the cake this is this is also a, a, um, a homemade frosting I did with just coconut milk um, a little sugar uh, one of the uh, low glycemic sugars that I used and um and a little coconut oil that's what that leaves coconut oil I think a, a little coconut oil just to make this make the um the frosting and Man, it is delish. It, it, it came out better than the cake. <laughs> it came out better than the cake. But, and so, um, the video I'm doing, I did before this is I showed that I, what I did from the, um, the seed nuts, milks, which was the sesame and the hemp seed. I used the pulp for the topping. I toasted it. I, I mentioned what how what I did to it in the video I dropped before this one. Okay. Um, well, actually, it's still loading. And I decided, well, I'm going to use those seeds, the seed pups, you know, that I dried out and made. I'm going to put it on top of this cake as well. So it has two toppings, the coconut, the toasted coconut, and then the toasted um, sesame and hemp seeds. Y'all, it's good. It's good, 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 good. It's goodness. And I just wanted to share that with y'all. And whoever wants the recipe for this cake, it's a good, it is a very good recipe. Like I said, it's just I messed up my fault. It's my fault. Ain't nothing to do with the recipe. And so whoever wants to try the recipe, let me know. And I will definitely link it in the description. I'm not going to do it before the end because I need y'all to talk to me. What's wrong? Can I give y'all a lot of love? <laughs> So, yeah, with that said, um, I, if you enjoyed this video, this, this digital visual, visual and, uh, I thank y'all for sharing the space with me. Y'all are, are very much appreciated. You are. You always are. And so, yeah, let me know how you feel about what I did with the double toppings. And if you would like the recipe to make it for yourself. And with that said, y'all lovely people, enjoy the rest of your early day, your afternoon, or your evening, depending on where you are in the world. And this is just Spontaneous Healthy Meals. Please stay tuned.